Restaurant chain Bob Evans, under pressure from activist investor Sandell Asset Management, said late Thursday it will consider monetizing its real estate. The company's board gave the nod for a transaction that includes either a sale leaseback or a tax-free spinoff consisting of a real estate investment trust of up to 60% of its roughly 500 locations. The move was announced on the eve of a Friday deadline to nominate dissident director candidates, and the deal's senior editor, Ron Oral, is reporting that it likely staved off a proxy fight. Bob Evans' stock is up more than 3% in midday trading in reaction to the news after tumbling in early March when the company said it would not sell its food processing business. The company has been in the crosshairs of Thomas Sandell of Sandell Asset Management for over a year now. The activist has pushed for Bob Evans to both monetize its real estate and to consider selling its food processing division, BEF Foods. Citing a person familiar with the situation, Oral reported that a sale leaseback of 60% of the chain would be worth close to $500 million, while the sale of BEF could bring in another $100 million. According to Oral, Sandell was weighing whether to nominate a short slate of candidates for Bob Evans' board. But in light of the Thursday announcement, Oral is reporting that the activist is no longer planning on launching a proxy contest. I'm Richard Collins with The Deal Report.